Hi, welcome. This is Gigi and this is a tower reading for Leos. Hi, Leo. How are you? My Leos, you know I miss you so much. I haven't done a reading for you in I think maybe over a week, maybe less. I'm not sure, but I do have a few videos you can watch for December 2020. I've been told many times that my readings resonate sometimes weeks, months, okay, after. So go ahead and go check those out. This is a general reading. In the future, you guys, I'm just going to say general, okay, general. Let's not waste any time, Leos, and see what the message is for you today. Oh, wow. Mm, amazing. Put the light this way. Okay, so we're starting very strong with the strength card here. Looking uh, at something from the past, okay? But it's still, it's a major arcana, so the energy is very present. It's about endurance, strength. It's about being in some type of hostile environment and still be able to merge with the energy, control uh, the crowd, control, uh, having a certain amount of comfort in some environment that it may be a little bit challenging, okay? And the control that person has, as you can see, it's not a physical control. It's, a, it's really a mental control, all right? Because she, uh, uh, she has him just walking beside uh, this woman here, him meaning the lion, okay, the animal. This also represents... Uh, Leo sign, okay? So that could be you, my Leos. That could be uh, you in this reading coming out very, very uh, comfortable, okay? I sense, I get the sense that there's a few things that you're looking at in 2020 that you definitely want to, maybe there's some thoughts about the past here. It could be someone, I'm not too sure, the two of pentacles here coming in very strong. It's in a reverse, okay? So Two of Pentacles in a reverse is having an issue choosing, okay? So maybe you're looking at something you chose in the past, some action you did, or uh, maybe you wish uh, someone missed, wished they made a different decision about you, uh, my Leos. With the Nine of Cups, which is a very, very uh, fertile energy, I feel that mm, one of your wishes is about to come true, okay? Beside the fact that you are Leos, in a comfortable position okay the position that you are could be at work could be at home things are going quite all right okay there's something that you want that's going to come in very quickly in 2021 okay i feel that with the four of pentacles you know you're protecting your heart you're not giving everything okay so there's definitely something about the past that you're not going to bring in 2021 all right. I'm not sure if you wish you have done something different. I'm, I wouldn't say that. Okay. But the two of pentacles is definitely a choice in choosing, uh, a choice in choosing, uh, difficulty in choosing something. Okay. So maybe you haven't done a choice and the choice is going to be done for you. The, uh, most high is going to make the most favorable, uh, situation happen in your way for your benefit here. That's why I see with the nine of cups. That's what it means, wish coming true. And the four of pentacles, you really are protecting yourself. So you want to come from a loving heart, okay? You don't want to give everything, all right? Maybe it could be in terms of your finances, okay? But there's something about your security. But I kind of feel with the four of pentacles is like emotional security here, all right? So we have a lot of cups in your reading, Leos. It seems that love is definitely going to manifest something about love here with the six of cups this energy it's about sharing okay i i kind of feel there's some energy that could also relate to your reading that has to do with maybe a donation all right with the six of um the six of cups uh but really it's nostalgia okay it's youth maybe you'll be reconnecting with your child qualities maybe other people uh friends wants to connect with you for your child like qualities because Leos are fun, okay? And like I said in many readings, when I say Leos, I don't mean Leo's sun sign particularly, okay? Because the sun is a luminary and it changes every 30 days. Right now, your sun, if your sun is in Leo, 
is actually in your sixth house because it's in Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn is sixth house away from you. So astrology, learning astrology is very beneficial when you get a reading. So let's go back to uh, your spread here, my lovely Leo. So the six of cups, there's some nostalgia about someone from the past. You're thinking about someone from the past. And there's a big cups here, six of cups. I mean, six of cups, wait, next to the big cups, which is the ace of cups. Ace of cups is really is a beginning of a relationship. All right. So there could be a relationship from the past that is coming back here, Leos. I mean, not sure if you want to manifest it, but the most high is about to bring your relationship, whether you're ready or not, is coming. It's coming strong. I have the ace of cups. It really is a beginning of a relationship. Okay. It could also be for some of you a beginning of a family. Okay. Maybe you're starting your family. Okay. It's up to you. The Nine of Cups, you get to make a wish and you get to have that wish fulfilled right away. Okay. The Two of Pentacles, the only thing that I see Two of Pentacles here in a reverse is really it's about making a choice. It could be about your career. It could be about uh, your time, how you want to invest your time going forward, Leos. Two of Swords in a reverse. Nine of Wands in a reverse. And the Two of Cups in a reverse. It's about that choice. Whatever choice you're going to be making is going to either uh, allow you to go forward or not. Make sure you make that decision because the Nine of Wands here, looking at the, look, that's the Nine of uh, Wands. Okay, Nine of uh, Rods. It's a fire energy. Okay, and this fire energy in this position, it's not going forward. All right. It's in the reverse. All right. You want your dream, your wish, whatever that is to come forward, but you don't don't conflict your yourself right here. Maybe you get too much of everything. I'm not sure. OK, but I feel that with the nine of wands here, what I see is, you know, something is not going forward. OK, um, it could be about your relationship or the relationship that is coming. Don't get in your way, Leos. Don't get in your own way. Two of Cups now in a reverse. You don't want to manifest someone from the past, maybe. I mean, Two of Cups in a reverse is separation. It's an unstable relationship. You know, depending of the choice you're making, okay, you might delay yourself in 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 getting what you want here. If it's not meant for you, the strength card says that you have endured a long time of not getting what you want, maybe in a relationship or not just really being interested in relationships. She's turning her back here. All right. The strength card is very important here because it does represent you, my Leos. You're standing right now, your position, which is very strong. But in a reverse, it's it's like it could also be that you're meeting a stronger opposition. It could be also wasting some your effort. It's definitely, I mean. It's not in a reverse, but I, I kind of feel that it could lead to that if you don't really make the right decision. Two of Pentacles is is in a reverse. It's like something that you desire. You're not making the right decision. Two of Swords. So two twos next to each other here, my uh, Leos. I mean, Two of Swords is kind of it's a direct energy, especially when it's it's reverse. It's uh, you made you're making a loose a lucid. A lucid, I can't speak. Uh, are you making a lucid, a lucid uh, decision? Okay. What's the word I want to choose instead of lucid? Because I feel like I said it in French. You're making uh, a, a cerebral or practical, practical. Let's say this. You're making a practical decision. Okay. You're making a practical decision. It's in a reverse. It's not in, in, the, in the right position. It really does. In the decision, you're, you need to compromise. But like you're really here 
you're making a practical decision about a relationship which you don't wish to go forward in a past relationship you don't want you don't want it you don't want to manifest it you don't want to reconnect it and you're saying to yourself i don't want it i you don't even put your energy your thoughts into it but it's coming i'm not sure because it's a relationship you're not looking for a relationship but it says it's coming the ace of cups is here really strong is the beginning it may not i mean I think there's someone that is lingering around you, okay? You may not see it right now, but you're making a decision. Maybe you're making a decision to ending to end the relationship with a friend, okay? That doesn't have to be love. Maybe a friend that you have involved yourself emotionally, that you have given maybe more that you wanted to, okay? And now you're making the decision not to go forward and maybe by not participating in their... Maybe there's going to be some type of uh, um, gathering and you're deciding not to go, not to participate. There's something that you're, dis that you're deciding not to participate, not to give energy into it. What the Spirit says about that, Four of Cups is in a reverse, Five of Pentacles in a reverse, and the Queen of Pentacles. Ooh! There's something of, of the past that's going to have to, that I feel that you're going to revisit, Leo's. Four of Cups in a reverse. I feel like this energy here is about, like, gaining enthusiasm. You know what I mean? It's about an opportunity that's coming your way. In this position, the Four of Cups is really like being tired and dissatisfied with drawing. But in a reverse, you're gaining enthusiasm about an opportunity five of pentacles here in a reverse you're gonna find stability five of pentacles you're gonna find stability you're looking for stability stability is coming five of pentacles is in a reverse it's finding abundance but you're guarding your heart Next to the four of, of pentacles, you're protecting your heart. You're going to have, whoo, I would never thought I would say this to Leo's, but you're going to have to take a chance. Seems like it. Because I don't know. Now, you can't withdraw yourself like this when things are manifesting all around you and it's about you. Queen of pentacles in a reverse. There's a lack of confidence here. Someone doesn't really, truly, and also I feel someone doesn't care for themselves, like, like, a, just a, you know, really healthy way of caring for yourself, you know, for men to, you know, how to groom yourself, a woman, how to, you know, uh, keep herself beautiful, beautiful, there's someone who's lacking confidence and they're not doing the work on that. They're not investing right now, protecting their heart. I'm going to end this reading, you guys, here for you. I'm going to continue in the extended reading so I can really look into this. Um, I, I didn't know that some of my Leos, depending on where um, it actually, uh, the Leo sign fall for you, might be experiencing this. You don't have to be a participant in your reading. You could be observer and observant. Okay, but I also feel that I want to say that this reading also could resonate with someone who has a Capricorn sign, okay, because the sun is there in their house right now, okay? But let me end this reading here, and let's uh, meet again in the extended. The instruction will be below the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave. Until next time, send you lots of kisses. I love you.